The original ThinkPad came out in 1992, and to celebrate that quarter century of innovation, Lenovo is introducing the ThinkPad 25, a specially modified ThinkPad T470 that has some of the great classic touches of yesteryear. The main differences you'll note between this and a regular ThinkPad T470 are all in the design. Most importantly, the keyboard, which was a chiclet keyboard on the T470, has been swapped out for a classic Lenovo seven row keyboard. This keyboard has some extra keys. It has dedicated audio buttons for lowering and raising the volume and muting, something that makes it a lot easier than hitting a function key like you have to do on today's keyboard. And of course, my favorite part of the new keyboard are the page forward and page back buttons that allow you to go forward and back in a web browser without lifting your hand off the keyboard. Uh, you'll also notice that this deck here is a soft touch, uh, which gives you an overall much better typing experience than on the T470. And you may notice that the track point cap on this is the old style original track point cap but don't worry, it comes with more modern caps and you can switch it out. One other thing you get is the packaging itself. The box is made to look like a Japanese bento box as the original ThinkPad was. It opens up to reveal the notebook inside along with a neat book by Lenovo designer David Hill about ThinkPad design. The ThinkPad 25 is basically a T470 on the inside, but it's been souped up and it only comes in one configuration. You get a Core i7 processor, 16 gigs of RAM, a 512 gigabyte NVMe SSD, and you get a couple things that you can't readily get on a ThinkPad T470. You get NVIDIA 940MX graphics, and you get an infrared camera for doing facial recognition. And it's got a 4G modem. Also, you're getting a 1080p touchscreen, which is something that you can get on a T470, but is not standard. You're getting a lot of power and a lot of performance for your money. The ThinkPad 25 uses Lenovo's PowerBridge battery technology, which means that you can pull the battery out and pop in a spare without rebooting. Now, perhaps because of the touchscreen and the Core i7 processor, this got slightly lower battery life than the T470, which we tested, which didn't have a touchscreen. So this ThinkPad really does a great job of combining classic ThinkPad elements like the keyboard and modern conveniences like the PowerBridge battery swapping and a modern processor. But there are a couple opportunities that Lenovo missed to make this even more classic. We would have loved to have seen the Think Light, an overhead light that let you read in the dark on older ThinkPads. And of course, the screen here is a standard 16 by 9 resolution when old fashioned ThinkPads use different aspect ratios like 4 by 3 or 16 by 10, which would have been cool to see in the modern era. Uh, but overall, the ThinkPad T470 has been one of our favorite business notebooks. And this ThinkPad 25 takes that design and concept and improves on it. So if you can afford its relatively high price, which is reasonable given the components inside, we strongly recommend the ThinkPad 25 as one of the best productivity notebooks you can buy.